Hey, I'm Katie Lee. Welcome to an all new What Would Katie Eat Home Edition. And today I'm making kiwi blueberry quinoa yogurt parfaits. Now, like a lot of you, I haven't been able to see my friends or family for a long time and I'm really missing them, but I keep up with a lot of video chats. And today I thought I'd check in with my best friend, Kelly. We've been friends since we were 16. We're both completely food obsessed. Kelly's a registered dietitian and she has a great blog and her social media page at Veggie Mom Cooks is filled with great recipes like these blueberry muffins. They're vegan and gluten free. So I thought I'd call her up and say, how'd I do? Kelly, hi. So good to see your face. I miss you so much. I miss you too. Well, you're here in spirit because I made your skinny oh, blueberry muffins. And what do you think? They're freaking delicious. No surprise. Oats are so amazing. They're high in fiber, high in iron, and folate that we need for a healthy pregnancy. So eat oh, wow. them every day. Whenever I think about our friendship, I think about all the times that we've had good meals together. And if you remember, our very first bonding was in high school at lunch hour when you started choking on a carrot. And you went right in there to save my life without hesitation. That's how I knew you'd be my best friend for life. <laughs> well, I am eating for two, so I'm going to go fix my second breakfast. It's something I think would get your seal of approval. It's okay. kiwi blueberry quinoa yogurt parfait. That sounds amazing. Send me the recipe. Yeah, the quinoa's got protein, right? Absolutely. All of the essential amino acids, perfect for pregnancy. You got this. Woo -woo. <laughs> All right, I'll call you later. Okay, I love you. <laughs> love you too. I love this recipe because it has such great flavor. It's really adaptable. It's healthy for me and healthy for this little bun in the oven. But before we get started, be sure to subscribe. All right, first thing I'm going to do is cut up some kiwi. So let me show you how I like to do this. I just take off each end of the kiwi. And then I take my knife around, almost like when you're doing an orange, when you're going to suprim an orange. And you just take the peel right off. I really love kiwi because they're full of vitamin C and they have a lot of fiber in them. But they're great during a time like this when you're not shopping as much because they don't go bad very quickly. So buy a hard kiwi and it'll last you a long time. And now I'm just gonna take my knife through and chop them up. There we go. And now onto my yogurt. So I have some plain Greek yogurt here. I really like to use plain yogurt instead of buying flavored ones and then add my flavorings to it because there's a lot less sugar that way. So I'm gonna start off with some lemon. You could use lime, you could use orange, or you could leave out the citrus altogether. I think lemon is great with blueberry. To me, it's just like one of those classic pairings. All right, lemon zest goes in. If you want it to be even more lemony, you can add more zest or you can add some of the juice as well. And then I'm gonna put just a little splash of vanilla extract. Ryan, I can hear your stomach growling. Are you hungry? <laughs> I heard it. And some honey. So if you don't have honey, you could use maple syrup, agave nectar, or if you don't want any sweetener at all, you can just leave that out as well. Like I said, this recipe is really customizable. All right, get all that honey, all that goodness off of there. And just mix it up. So now I have a vanilla lemon yogurt and I love Greek yogurt it's just so satisfying the way that it's so thick and creamy and it's full of protein so I've been trying to up my protein since I'm pregnant because pregnant women need more protein all right I'm gonna make these parfaits kind of fancy so I'm gonna pipe the yogurt in so I've got a plastic baggie inside of a glass this just makes it easier you can also use a piping bag but I don't have any and then just put it right in there. These can be made in advance, so they're great for a party or say a baby shower. But I like doing things special just for me and Ryan. It's a way to keep things interesting right now, is to have just like those little extra touches. Like we're doing cocktail nights for me and mocktail, and we get dressed up and he makes little aperitivo platters. 
and it's just a nice way to keep it interesting. All right, so I'm going to take this and kind of shake it down and seal it up, and let's build these parfaits. I'm going to start out with some blueberries. So just a few blueberries on the bottom. Put a couple kiwi in there. And now I'm just going to snip the end off of a piping bag and pipe this yogurt right in. So a little bit of yogurt. And then I'm going to top it with some quinoa. Quinoa is usually a two to one ratio of water to quinoa and then cook it about 15, 20 minutes and let it cool completely. Order your package directions. So it's a little unusual to be having quinoa for breakfast, but I really like it as a replacement for oats or granola, especially in this parfait, because it is so high in protein. So one cup of quinoa has eight grams of protein and get this five grams of fiber. That's what I'm talking about. Good stuff in there. But of course, you could use oats, you could use uh, camlet, you could use farro, whatever kind of grain you have, even brown rice. I'm going to add some slivered almonds for some crunch. And then I'm going to just rebuild. And I'm going to top it with some more of those almonds. I'm gonna put just a couple of blueberries so you know what it is. Oops, they're flying everywhere. And a couple pieces of kiwi. You know, I've always been big on balance of having the healthy stuff and a few little naughty items, but I think I've been pretty good. Don't you think so, Ryan? I haven't been eating too much, right? Right. You better watch it. <laughs> Well, this looks beautiful. I'm gonna make one more for you and then we're gonna go have a nice special breakfast outside. What do you think? This is actually pretty good. <laughs> Stop it with that, actually. I really love the yogurt, the way that it has the lemon and the vanilla. I think it really comes through and it's not too sweet. I like the texture too with those almonds in there. So fresh. Mm -hmm. Not bad. This is a great way to keep your mornings really healthy, easy, and also special. So from my own tears, stay healthy, stay cozy, and keep on cooking.